Puebla. What is good, YouTube? It is the one and only Afro Boy here, and in today's video, the main question is: Is it time to upgrade from last gen? Now, before we get into this video, this informational video. Be sure to realize that this is some of it's opinion and some of it is facts as I will explain to you in the video. And be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. Don't hit the dislike button. Just hear me out and I promise you, you won't be sorry for hearing me out. And I'm pretty sure that some of you would agree, alright? Alright, so, let's get into it, alright? So, this is sad news for last gen. And yes, it is time for you to upgrade from last gen if you have last gen the upgrade from um next gen which would be a ps4 and the xbox one so from the xbox 360 to the xbox one or ps3 to the ps4 or xbox 360 to the ps4 or ps3 to the xbox one don't do that one do the other one all right so yeah so yeah it's time to upgrade now first thing i'm gonna tell you is a fact all right now in the game before um issue 194 on page 17 they have the PS3, the Nintendo Wii, and Xbox 360 on this page, right? And on this page, they have the year it came out, well, the, the day that it was released, all right? So for the PS3, it was released November 17, 2006, and the Xbox 360 was released November 22, 2005. We're not going to talk about the Wii. We're just going to leave it at that, all right? We're not going to talk about it, okay? <laughs> All right, so stated here by the company plan, it says Sony has expressed its firm commitment to a 10-year plan. Now, I remind you that this came out in 2006, so that means 10 years will make 2016. So that means in 2016 there will be the um pretty much Sony would just not do anything to PS3 no more, but it will become another PS2. Now, Xbox One or Microsoft now they did say that they um that 2016 would be the last year that they would um you know stop messing with um last year. well not stop messing with it but you know stop doing the updates and everything and pretty much stop making you know games released for next gen so 2016 is the expiration date for the PS3 and Xbox 360 now now this is not for some of you not to get mad you know don't get mad and be like oh well they don't care about this you know. They just forgot all about the 360, blah, 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 this and that. No, you, no, just think about this, man. Everything has an expiration date, all right? The PS2 had its expiration date. The Xbox had its expiration date. The PS, the PlayStation, the number one, PS1, had its expiration date. And if you don't even see that as um um an example, how about this? The iPhone, the first one, had its expiration date. The i um, I guess the 3GS, I think, had its expiration date. Um, the iPhone 4 had its expiration date. Even the Samsung, Samsung 1, expiration date. Samsung 2, expiration date. And this can just go on and on about everything that has expiration date. Nothing lasts forever. So that's something that you have to realize when it comes to these, um, the companies that they can't, like, the PS3 and the Xbox 360 had its limitations. Now, the games that's being created now has certain graphics and other components that um that's in the games that cannot that has to be well, how would you say worked around in order to fit into the xbox 360 and as was stated in the gta update that the rockstar editor and no loading screens and all that wouldn't fix wouldn't fit in the xbox 360 and or the ps3 like firmware so you know these things are just made with um they have limitations all right so that's why new things are created so that these limitations would never be reached all right and that's the same thing goes for a pc if you buy a graphics card right you have a graphics card for over two years and then a program comes out and that graphics card is no longer compatible with that program so you have to go and buy another graphics card you know there's many things that you can um that you can say about this many things that you can come up with you know about examples for why it is time to upgrade from last gen all right just like i said this is not for something for you to get mad at don't get mad at the companies don't get mad at that there's nothing to get mad about you know you should be happy that there are new things being created um for us so that way we can experience more things like more HD, you know, games are starting to look real and realer every single day, alright, 
So you, this is something you have to realize, and yes, it is time to upgrade from last gen. Like I was saying, don't get mad. You know, I, I don't want to say this because I know some people might get mad, but it's just it's just something that we have to face. You know, we just have to face the fact that last gen, their time is up. Expiration date is coming. 2016 is the expiration date for last gen, and some games already started um, proposing and stopping you know certain things from last gen now you're st you're still getting games you obviously can tell that you're still getting games black ops 3 you still have the multiplayer you just won't have the story mode so the um companies are slowly 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 um tuning down stuff for um xbox 360 and ps3 which is basically last gen so yes just like i said it is time to upgrade just um yeah it's just time to upgrade guys so like I said, don't get mad. But that's the end of the video. Um, hit that like and subscribe button. It's the one only Apple boy. And guess what? I'm out.